Janelle, I remember it like it was yesterday, the day we met. I had just finished playing a game. You had driven from Boston to Buffalo. I was covered in dirt and sweat. You had just been sat in a car for seven straight hours. Our first date was to a dive bar to get mac and cheese. How romantic. <laughs> On that date, as we shared our mac and cheese, I sat there knowing in my heart that I was gonna marry you. Just four short years later, here we are. The happiest, most amazing day of our lives. Ryan, today I stand before you in front of our closest family and friends, searching for the words to describe the way I feel about you. I wouldn't be able to say how I feel about you without first properly thanking our sport that so graciously brought us together. The sport that we were sad to walk away from, only to run into each other's arms. For 18 years, a softball diamond was my home. A place of peace, a place of comfort, joy, and success. After pouring my heart and soul into the game I loved more than anything, softball rewarded me with the greatest blessing of my life, you. Don't fall asleep. Don't wake up from We're all here to celebrate the love shared by these two amazing people and I am truly honored to be here uniting Jan Ryan and my beautiful sister Janelle. But more than that, I'm happy just knowing that she will be in no better hands than the man who she's currently holding hands with. <laughs> Look at today not as the beginning but as the continuation of your love into the next chapter. Make every day better than the last, not because you should, but because you know no other way. Make every moment worth remembering because time isn't the only currency that matters and where we spend it, we can never return it. I don't think Ryan could have picked a better woman to marry today. Over time, I have learned that Janelle and Ryan are very similar. Not only did they play, they both played baseball and softball, were both catchers, MVPs, all region and all conference, and wore 20. <laughs> Janelle is also strong, determined, and mindful. Janelle is always positive and always finds a way to put a smile on my face. I'm excited to say that today, I finally got the sister I never had, but always wanted. But to Janelle, you already know this by now way better than I do, but uh, Bono is a dime a dozen. Um, he's a tremendous guy that puts his heart and soul into everything that he does. Um, I've watched this man dive head first into fences while we're losing by 10 to catch a foul ball. <laughs> so if that doesn't tell you how good and how much he's gonna try to be the best husband he can be in everything. I don't know what else I can tell you from there. <laughs> I know I speak for all of us that we could not be happier for the two of you and the beginning of this new chapter together. To bear witness to such a great love and partnership is truly a blessing. As Rumi once said, the minute I heard my first love story, I started looking for you. Not knowing how blind that was, lovers don't finally meet somewhere. They are in each other all along. I know that is true for the two of you. She will never leave your side. She will fight for your relationship always. 
she will love you with all her soul. And most of all, she will always look to bring out the best that she sees in you. I look forward to the memories our families will share in this lifetime, and I am so glad to have you as my brother-in-law. Welcome to this crazy, beautiful family. Our relationship is my pride and joy. It is the very best accomplishment of my life. You light up my world every single day with your words, with your smile, and the way you so genuinely love me. Janelle, I promise to be the best husband I can be and to continually strive to be the best day by day. I promise that no matter what challenge, battle, or adversity we face, we'll face this together. Thank you for always believing in me, for being relentlessly patient with me, for dreaming with me, and for building our future together with our love as the foundation. I promise to be faithful for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, and I vow to honor you and love you until death do us part. You showed me home is a feeling, not always a place. Choosing to pack my bags and move to New York three years ago was the best decision in my life because I wasn't really leaving. I was going home to be with you. Ryan Bonafidi, do you take Janelle Marie Bouchard in sickness and health, richer and poorer, to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. Janelle Marie Bouchard, do you take mm. Ryan Bonafidi to be your lawfully wedded husband in sickness and health, for richer and poorer, and forever or worse? I do. And by the power vested in me, <laughs> by the University of Life Church, and by the state of Maine, I pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride.